Alright guys, let me talk about the Premier League Player of the Month for October, so if you guys will enjoy this video, and if you do, please smash that button down below. So for this SBC, should be on the 12th November, so don't need to rush into your investments if you are going to invest. I'm not sure if investing for this is going to be the best thing in the world as well, but in this video I will show you the players which I would recommend going for if you do want to invest. So this month, Salah, he's pretty much going in the bag and I can't really see anyone else win it. Like He's got five goals, four assists for the month and... He's just ahead of everyone else by a mile for the month. There's other players like Foden, Reese James, Cornet, who could potentially have a chance, but Salah should have in the bag, so for this video, we'll be focusing on him and going to go into the investments right now. Right, so first off this video, we're going to start with some players for Liverpool, so this is a common requirement, just a player from the players' club. So um, when it comes to the non-rare cards, you can pick these up for like 400, 450 through bidding, so... Um, they're very low risk investments, could be good for other SBCs as well which take them up, but for the Salah SBC, I don't think they'll be that great, so um, yeah, maybe worth picking some up for other SBCs at 400, 450, but for the Salah SBC, probably not going to be great. At 650 just here, so for the rare gold ones, very low risk one, got the Ox Canate, discard for like 40 coins under that as well, so um, safe investments, but once again, not really that sure about them. When it comes to other cards in Liverpool though, you do have players like Matip who potentially, if you pick him up a little bit early, could just go up from the hype. Like at the second through by now, I think he's 950. Spammed at that price there, 900 coins. Got a load of cards there as well. So someone like Matip potentially could be a good player to buy and then sell in the hype before the SBC drops. So um, maybe take a look at him. Also got players like Jordan Henderson, a decent 84 raid card just here. So um Clicks the wrong thing there. Costs around 2,000 coins the second, so 2,100 coins. Once again, could be a player you pick up now. Sell just for the SBC comes out in the hype and hope it's price gone up a nice amount by then. You also got players like Firmino and Thiago, also Fabinho, who you can take a look at as well. I'm going to go into the next tip right now. Next up for this video, again, take a look at some Team of the Week players. So when it comes to an SBC like Salah, it's going to require some Team of the Week cards. Will they go up by much? I'm not really sure at the sense the market is so weird for these cards, but. It's worth just keeping one of these cards in your club anyway for each of them. So, um, Cramrich all the way down to um, Milinkovic Savage just there. They're a very good price. Try to pick them up through Binnen as well, like say a few K per card. And it just makes some safe investments to keep in your club. And at some point in the future, they're going to go up and hopefully be Salah that takes them up. And as well, Aspi, Mason Mount. Potentially, there could be a little bit of pre hype there with them being in the Premier League, which could take the price up a little bit. So, um, yeah, definitely pick up one of them. Take a look at all these cards though. I'm going to go into the next tip right now. Next up for this video, going to be taking a look at some of the high red fodders. So, I'm going to skip straight to the 87 red cards. But if you want to pick up some 84, 85, 86 red cards, you can. And also, when picking up these cards, would recommend waiting a few days. The price of the second, they're currently up slightly. So, um, Chesney, for example, he was 10k a few days back. A few days before, that was 14k. So, um, once the market drops again a little bit, that's probably going to be the best time to invest. And for these cards, I'm going to use the Ronaldo SBC for an example. Now, when that came out, it was mainly the La Liga ones that went up slightly, so um, Aguero, Modric, Cruz, Suarez, Benzema, Courtois, Casemiro, Ter Stegen, or Black. They could potentially be the best ones to like take a look at based on the Ronaldo SPC. Could be different this time, so it's up to you really which ones you want to invest in. But for me, probably going to focus on the La Liga ones, but that will be it for this video now. So hopefully you enjoyed. If you have, make sure you smash the like button down below, and peace.